donated by Arnett's trailer sales trophy in this class of most trophies in the time. Well, if you look at page number 36 and 37 of the Horseshoe Program, you'll see you have a coupon in there for a program supplement. You can go in the Horseshoe Office. Okay, they're calling class number 987. Classic pleasure going in the arena. This is Mikey Bowen. This is Stanley Tipton. Travis Robinson. Pleasure is in the ring. They're going at a show gate. Mikey Bowen. Jeff Hill. Charlie Beatley. Vernon Stamper. Stanley Tipson. We've got Henry Elam and Doug Spears right behind him. Pick them up in a minute. Here's Derek Tipson. Travis Robinson. Keep an eye on them. Doug Spears. Oh, and Josh Murdoch is in here. I think that's it. <laughs> Great class.
Class 98 in the World Grand Championship. You'll be next as Class 97 has reversed Class 98 in the World Grand Championship. You'll be next. Third in reverse on the show walk. Timeout has been called in the class. It can be either uh, equipment breakage or uh, something that's we'll the 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 want here to class continue. Gentlemen, it's classic pleasure headed for the lineup. If you would and evidently they were going to call for a lineup anyway. And you'll start waking your mates to the shoot, please. As class 97 told him to go on to the lineup as they were going to ask for that anyway if he wanted to stay. Otherwise, they would have given him permission to leave the arena. A great line of men's classic pleasure. As we mentioned before, the judge will walk the line up along with the ringmaster. Uh, looks like Honorable Tom Davis is the judge who's walking the lineup, asking the horses to back at least a minimum three steps back, willingly, quietly. The other judges stand back and watch that each of the horses perform the backing correctly. This is not just a formality, but it is judged. Three judges again is Tom Davis, 
Scott McGregor, and Charlie Brown. You can register in the Horse Show office. There are classes for best dressed, biggest dog, smallest dog, best hairdo, best trick, most like owner, and most obedient. A three-time world champion, Eloise Whitley, not with us here this year. So this wide open competition for our World Show Dog Show here in 2010. That'll be 1 o'clock tomorrow on the Trail Obstacle Course. class is full of uh, trainers. We have Derek Tipton, we have Doug Spears, Michael Bowen, Vernon Stamper, Henry Elam, Jeff Hill, Josh Murdoch, Stanley Tipton, and Charlie D'Atley. Beautiful night here at the Kentucky Equestrian Center in Winchester, Kentucky. This is the United Mountain Horse World Grand Championship. It began on Monday and will continue on until Saturday night. Continuing World Grand Champion classes. We'll bring you tomorrow night's Grand Championship classes also. This is brought to you by Visible Web Design. Morris Drake, Vanessa Crow. Some of the crowd in the background and some. Class number 97 has been men's classic pleasure. Trophy in the class donated by our next trailer sales of Mount Sterling. Ribbons in the class sponsored by Dragons Meet LLC of Winchester, Kentucky. Winner of this class just a year ago, it was RHF Mercy Me with ST Tipton Riding for the Real Horse Farm. Welcome to the Winner Circle, our 2010 Men's Classic Pleasure World Champion. Make back to back, it's Mercy Me with ST Tipton. Well, congratulations to Stanley the Tipton. Real Horse Farm of the Unicorn, Tennessee. It's, it's RHF Mercy Me. Second return to the Grand Championship. Winning our men's classic pleasure title. Class 97 is done. Class 98, the other World Grand Championship. We need you guys in the shoot, please. They'll go over Class to the winner circle where they'll do a ribbon presentation. Second in the class goes to 307 Cash. And the Elon the Rider for Louise Tongs of Franklin, Kentucky. 307 is second. Third ward goes to 929. Hit the big time. Josh Murdoch riding from Jim Leak of Cedar Creek, Texas, 929 is third. Fourth is 149 above the law. Derek Tipton, the rider from Forrest to Joseph in Lost Creek, Kentucky, 149 in fourth place. Fifth goes to 404 Nighthawk. Vernon Samper, the rider from John Rickester of Keswick, Ontario, 404 is fifth and sixth to 410. Rocks, 12-5. Travis Robinson riding for Jeff Miller of Bowling Green, Kentucky. 410 is six. And Stanley's gonna take his victory ride on Mercy Me. Oh, he 
he's coming this away. So we'll just get a brief. Hey, they're calling for the Yearling World Grand Championship. They have qualified in the Wingland, I'm sorry, the Yearling Philly, the Yearling Stallion. And now this is a combination of the Philly and the Colt. Now this class is where they all walk around and they are judged on gait and of course confirmation uh, but gait is important too and so we'll watch for that and the confirmation of the horse is then judged. Um, this is always a good thing as far as colts and fillies uh, because of their breeding. We want to make sure that they are awarded correctly in order for those interested in breeding programs to choose. Choose well, I guess you would say. And we'll see if we can um, identify some of the handlers in this class. Again, the same three judges will continue to judge throughout the World Grand Championships. Temperament is also important to show the horses, temperament, gait, and confirmation. This is just really not a, a beauty pageant, but also, um, you know, about how the colt or filly is uh, performing. And uh, temperament, again, is important for our um, breed. Derek Tipton jumped off a horse, or that's, yeah, and is now leading one, so that's a quick change. Good. Good class. Okay, we'll see if we can identify the handlers for you. We'll come around here, I can see their faces in a moment. Now it looks like Michael Vaughn did a quick change too. well as ST Tipton. Number 207 is Stacy Tipton. 230 is Michael Bowen. And 163 is Stanley Kitchen.
This is Larry Patterson. And now in reverse, please. Second way of the race. Last night, you see, in reverse, last night, you said it's another class pleasure world grand championship. You'll be next as 98 has reversed. This is Kelly France. 17 and under classic pleasure world grand championship. You'll be next. They're on the reverse. Again, they're watching for gait, stride, movement. I apologize, I don't know this scrambler. Again, I don't have the class sheet in front of me. Again, I mentioned earlier that the horses had to qualify. So, um, I know uh, that most of these, if not all, were either first, second, or third. They were requested to come back into the championship or forfeit their winnings. Oh, no, I'm sorry. They don't forfeit their winnings. They're charged a uh, entry fee. They're required to return to the championship if they tie first, second, or third in their qualifying class. Again, it was individual classes of uh, Phillies and Colts. Okay, they've asked for the lineup, and this is where they'll, uh, again, as I said, we'll go ahead and uh, check their confirmation. 